Hi guys, Belle from Hampton Your House here with another video in the Decorate Your House for Free or Almost Free series. Today we're going to be making some gorgeous botanical leaf print paintings. And don't worry, you don't need to be a skilled painter for this at all. It's a very simple process but it looks very stylish and effective. Let's get painting. First, we're going to go outside and grab some leaves. Any interesting shaped leaves will do. I ended up using some weeds because we still don't have a lot of plants in our yard. Next, I grabbed some black paint and blue paint that I had on hand and started mixing my colour. I'm going with a really dark indigo colour for this project. I had some A3 watercolour paper sheets that I bought in a pad a while ago from Kmart. You could also use paper from a visual diary or get some from the newsagent. Now let's set up your leaves however you like, but try to keep it simple. Bigger leaves make a cleaner print and having fewer leaves looks the best. Then you can start rolling on the paint with a small paint roller. As you can see, I had an attempt before this one and it ended up looking too crowded and the fine details didn't show up well. So I made the mistake so you don't have to. Make sure you don't have too much paint on your roller. Keep it pretty dry. If you have too much paint, the edges of the leaves won't come out as cleanly. You might have to go slowly in some places to make sure you get the details while holding your leaf in the right place. Once you're happy with the coverage around the leaves, you can take them off and fill in the blank spaces around them, but don't go all the way to the edges of the page. We want a paint roller look around the edges as a stylistic feature. And finally, get your leaves back and press them face down over the white space where they were before to add back some of the detail of the leaves. Now I'm making a series of three paintings, so I've got some different types of leaves for the next two. Sometimes you need to press quite hard on your roller to get a nice print. And here's the finished product. I got my frames from Kmart, they were $15 each and everything else was completely free. I think these look amazing and so high end and they really make this space come to life. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this DIY as much as I've enjoyed creating it. I love the way these paintings turned out and I think there's so much scope for experimenting with different leaves and flowers and colors to suit your style. Don't forget to check out the playlist of my other Decorate for Free DIYs. I'll link that for you in the description box below. I've been having so much fun coming up with free or very budget friendly decor ideas that look expensive. So please check it out and I hope you find them inspiring. I'd love for you to subscribe so you don't miss any upcoming videos. Give this video a like if you enjoyed it and thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.